Welcome to HDTV. You're now rocking with your boy. Salt Life co-founder arrested on manslaughter charges, police say. A co-founder of Salt Life, the ocean-centric apparel brand, was arrested and charged with manslaughter in connection with the killing of an 18-year-old woman in South Florida. Court records show. Michael Troy Hutto, who is 54 years of age, appeared in court via video link Monday in Palm Beach County, where a judge set bond at $255,000. In addition to manslaughter, Hutto is also charged with possession of a weapon during a felony. Hutto was arrested October 30th at Baptist Medical Center South in Jacksonville, Florida, and booked into the Duval County Jail by Riviera Beach Police and Florida Highway Patrol in connection with the killing. The Highway Patrol tweeted this last week. <laughs> the parents of 18-year-old Laura Grace Duncan had called the Columbia County Sheriff's Office on October 26 to request a welfare check on their daughter. The Sheriff's Office said her father learned she was at a Hilton Hotel in Riviera Beach. The arrest affidavit says, and he said Hudo was her boyfriend. Riviera Beach is about 300 miles south of Columbia County. <laughs> Riviera Beach police responded to the hotel October 29th and found a woman's body with a gunshot wound to the stomach. The affidavit said the room was rented. In Hudo's name, it said, with his ID, phone, wallet, and belongings still inside. Detectives located Hudo at the hospital in Jacksonville, where he had been taken the previous day after asking for help at a gas station while shaking and making delusional comments, the affidavit said. When detectives spoke to Hudo in the hospital, he told him he thought he hurt Gracie and began to cry. The affidavit said he said they had been in the hotel room playing as if they were shooting with their finger and a gun. When he pointed a gun at Gracie and it went off, he said he left the room and drove until he ran out of gas. The arrest affidavit said CNN has reached out to Hudo's public defender but has not heard back. Hudo was one of our four co-founders of Salt Life formed in 2003 in Jacksonville Beach, Florida. The brand's name was taken from a tattoo on the back of Hudo's neck. According to a 2004 story in Jacksonville Business Journal, Delta Apparel acquired Salt Life in 2013. Salt Life offered its condolences in a tweet October 31st. Sadly, we have learned one of Salt Life's co-founders has been charged with a felony. Salt Life representative said in the tweet, Salt Life sends their utmost sympathies to the family and friends of the deceased. In 2013, the co-founders of Salt Life sold their entire business to the new owners. So basically, he said they were playing, was it with a gun? They were playing as if they were shooting with their finger and a gun. When he pointed a gun at Gracie, it went off. So they were playing with a gun, I suppose. And then he pointed it and it just went off and killed her. But the thing is, even though he felt it was an accident, he just left the scene. And he just left and bounced on it instead of just um calling the police right then and there. And um, letting them know what happened that it, that it accidentally went off. So now he done put himself in a bigger predicament. Um, but do you believe his story? They were just playing around and all of a sudden he was playing and then the gun just went off. You know, or, you know, something else could have happened. He could have found out she was with somebody or, you know, I, I know this isn't a TV show, but things like that, because the simplest things could trigger somebody to go crazy or to just flip their wig within that moment of time and um condolences to the family um who lost their um daughter that's very sad um her parents i know they're going through it um prayers go out to them i hope they can make it through this to lose a daughter and she was just a kid she was only 18 years old 
And to me, she's 18 and she's with a 54 year old. <laughs> that just that just lets you know, man, if you got money, you can have whatever you like. But um, to me, he was way too old for her. <laughs> That's me personally. But you can't tell nobody who 18 who to be with. And, you know, to me, being 18, you're at that age where you're trying things, trying new things, being with different partners, being promiscuous, being, you know, out there. And I mean, I she could have been you know, doing some things that he didn't like and he just snapped. You don't know what could have happened, but um, let me know in the comment section, what do you think? Do you think they were, you know, pointing, they, they were shooting with their finger and a gun or something? Do you believe they were playing with the gun and then all of a sudden when it ended up in Hudo's hands, he just accidentally shot it? Or do you think that there's something else to this story that he's not really telling us? Let me know in the comment section. Thank you for listening. Like, comment, subscribe, share this. Um, and I also feel that it's something that he's not saying. Um, something had to happen to me. But it could have been an accident. They were playing and the gun went off. But I think it might be more to it. Um, like I said, like, comment, subscribe, share, hit the notification bell to select all to receive upcoming content. And if you want to donate to the page, you can cash at me at the word welcome, the number two, and then HDIITV. Thank you for listening. We are out. Live boy.